And now a story you've seen only here on Local 10. Coral Gables commissioners, they have decided the fate of a city police officer accused of spying on someone she was supposed to protect. Local 10 News reporter Michael Seiden live in Coral Gables with the exclusive. Michael. Lori, we spent the day today inside City Hall, and let me tell you, this commissioner meeting was just full of emotion. There was tears, there were also laugh, laughter as well, but in the end, these commissioners voted 3-2 in favor of a separation agreement which essentially means that this police major will remain at home, collect a paycheck until her retirement in November. She sat in the front row just feet from her accuser. They didn't make eye contact, but police major Teresa Molina heard every word of Maria Cruz's emotional plea. I'm here to ask you to disregard the city manager's recommendation, uphold the sheets, and terminate Ms. Molina. Please. The chief of police, Ed Hudak, has been calling for the firing of the 23 year veteran since last month. That's when an internal affairs investigation revealed that Major Molina crossed the line when she started snapping photos of a text message conversation between crews and commissioners during a commission meeting last September. But the city manager disagreed with the recommendation after an independent investigator concluded that the punishment was too harsh. Today, the city commission voted 3-2 in favor of a separation agreement. The city manager's signature means Major Molina will remain at home, collecting a paycheck while using a combination of paid sick days and vacation until November when she's expected to retire with benefits. She's happy that the way that she has chosen to retire as an officer is the way that it's going to happen. It's Saturday in Coral Gables. Once again, we reward people to do wrong. She also made an effort to suppress free speech, and to me it's something embarrassing and we could do a lot better. And it should be noted that there were Coral Gables residents who came out to show support for Major Molina as well as Maria Cruz. And I also want to note that those commissioners who voted in favor of the separation agreement said, look, they realized that Major Molina crossed the line, but they said they looked at her 23 years of service. She had never been in trouble in the, fa in the past, and they all agreed that this was not a fireable offense. We are live tonight in Coral Gables. I'm Michael Seiden, Local 10 News. Michael.